Hello, Wild Witchers, this is Crimson, and you're watching some The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt, and our real boy left off after we killed a frosty mage of summoning stuff who teleported us underwater with his last breath. Still going top us because that didn't get us any XP, apparently. At least not enough to level. So let's board the... Indeed it is. Be a lot of potions to do that. Uh, you guys got that. I closed the portal for you. I didn't get to loot all those ice elementals, now I think about it. Get, you, get, I'll, I'll kill you with my phantom sword, creature. <laughs> it says silver sword equipped, but I don't have it equipped. Is that a little weird? I'm attacking like I have it out, but I obviously don't. Hot hunt warrior, you guys got that. I believe in you. Oh, look at that guy being bumped by. Who wants to taste steel? Yo, man. You seen Siri? By the Nagelfer! You got this. Look at that hot heal there. Whoosh. Oh. oh, now I got my fist out. It's foggy here. So, Skellige and Nilfgaard are fighting together against the Wild Hunt? Ah! Cran! Crunk! Crunk! Cran! Cranny! Any last words? Such a trap! You fight! You had your chance. I was hoping you'd come. Because? I've something to tell you. But I'll do so afterwards. As you expire. That was a rather juicy death. And crunch. And crate. Okay, so whooshing is your thing. Got it. Are you like, um, your lieutenant? Looks like he is. Except he parries. Interesting. Ow. Ow. He punched me. He has two swords and he punches. What a silly man. Nope, nice crit there. Still fighting your topless. Not much in potions now, I realize it. Okay, it's parry time. Seems to be time for me to get my shield back up. Looks like I can interrupt him. Can I burn him? Oh! You don't like it when I burn you! Well! This fight's gonna get a lot more interesting. Did I mention I'm a fire wizard? I'm a firebender is what I am. I don't have any tiny owl left, but... Well, um... Okay, he doesn't care that much for my flipping tree. Ow. Well done, well done. What the, What was that frost barrier thing? We'll, we'll go. Huh? I got it. Oh, that crit, though. Oh, is he putting up, like, frost armor that I can burn off? Whee! He could just do that at any time. That's fair. Can he not just throw me into, like, an active volcano? Teleporting away? Oh, man. 
Man, I wish I could do that. Ow. It's a pretty wide attack you have there. Okay, I'll get this up. Oh, and I'll do that too. I was doing this again. Oh no, it's something else entirely. Fool! Pop my sign. Well done. I wish I could, uh... Roll these two, ti two signs together without having to open up that menu so often. Probably would be able to do it if on PC controls. Like, hotkey them instead of switching. But I still prefer the gamepad. Ow! Hold on. Hold on. Out of swallow. I guess I could have a decoction. I'm gonna be careful about that though because of toxicity. I guess that's what I'm going with for now. Put this bomb on there just in case. Uh, yeah. I kind of want to eat food, too, just to be safe. As you know, I'm not wearing a shirt. I don't believe it myself, though. I feel like the fighting against the his lieutenant general gave me a lot of training. A lot of practice. Or, or I could die through my shield from that. It's okay too. Uh, I don't have elemental resist, and I assume that that's frost damage that kills me there. So, do I need to run around and wait him out on that? I guess I'll give that a shot next time he does that phase. Did we get mid boss fight checkpoints? Nope. To be honest, I wasn't expecting him to be doing this fight topless, but that's just how it worked out. At least I figured out that fire is effective ish. Chaining his attacks so is problematic. Hey, the parries are in my favor. I don't know whether I want to channel the fire on him when he's doing this or. There's no. See, you notice there he didn't do that much damage, but you know in that next phase he was doing like half my health bar when he hit connected. I get the feeling I should just wait out his teleportation phase, or dodge out. Okay. Hmm. His behavior is difficult to understand, it's not just... Memorizing patterns. And is there some significance to his frosty armor? What now, you piece of filth? Okay, my arrows are pointless. I feel like there is something. Oh. Alright, the phase transition. Now this one he starts with the sword uh, ground laser beam thing, so I'll try running left and right to dodge it. Right, that's what he does. I have a thought of alt signing that down to see if it blocks the projectile. Oh, it's because I got hit by three at once. I understand. So yeah, just wait that out, that's what you're supposed to do. Ow. That wasn't good for me. Okay, this is just a free run and get a hit or two.
Though I am just kind of realizing they put me boss fight and then another boss fight. Tag him one at a time, one swing at a time, one hit at a time. Be a very long fight that way. I get one hit from a sword. And he'll dodge away. Yep, yeah, he'll block after one hit. That was confusing. I think I can fire and then swing. Yeah. Probably how I'm gonna do it. Through that massive long health bar. For the armor reduction, or maybe it's a mechanic running off his frost. If that is supposed to be the mechanic, then this fight is way too long, or I'm too weak. Not sure which. But yeah, being able to hit him only one, once kind of sucks. Alright, here it comes. That was a weird swing pattern. Maybe I parry him? No, no, his swings are red. If that means anything. What now, you piece of film? Maybe I could parry him there. Doesn't look like he's swinging red there. In my experience, bosses just don't take to any kind of flipping tree like that. Oh, I can parry him, it seems like. Oh, but I guess he's teleporting behind me. Try to prevent that. Oh, and then he does the red one. Okay. I guessing parry is the answer to make this fight go faster. I feel like I'm do I do half damage while he has that frosty armor up. Pretty sure about it. And there I only did 60 though. But now he's not putting his armor back out. Oh no. Don't want to get hit by that point blank again. Make him come to me. Ooh. Yeah, is he not putting it up or is the graphic just not showing? Only doing 70 damage there. 
Maybe it's not even a thing. Oh, I'm gonna burn him, I guess. Oh, he should be frosty right now because he just teleported. So. Okay, yeah, he's he's getting it, just not appearing like he is. There he goes. He was just mad about me constantly burning it off. I feel like I don't have my barrier up. This is a little suicidal. Okay, parry, not a thing. Don't try. Oh, critical hit, 383, you see that? Nice for a change. Okay, that's tricky. Not because dodging the, uh, you know, getting cornered and stuff, and dodging his attack was, but because of the handling in the game. Yeah, crit for a half because of the... Uh... Ow. Didn't think my shield was up. Oh, yeah, he refreshes his frost armor every time he teleports. I'm coming, I'm coming. I just gotta wait on my stamina bar. I have two signs to basically constantly maintain. I wonder if my other signs would be as effective here. Like, could I be stunning him and then... Who knows? I'll quit my other swallow. Use it. Oh, my weapon for no real reason? That'd be a good idea. Nice crit there. I didn't teleport, I probably could have. Hit him again for regular damage. I just want to get those adrenaline bursts. Do you have a... Uh... No, he didn't have his shield refreshed. Whoops. That might cost me. Oh, not really. And stand in Yurden. I wonder if I actually made this into uh, the alternate one. Be effective in draining his health, you know? Woo. Well played, sir, using the corners like that. This is that one. But yeah, it's hard to measure how far Geralt's gonna run on that attack. But make it very difficult to dodge if you can just outrange it. I'm gonna cast this to be safe. I wonder if I was using like an axe or something. I could be able to break through his parry. Like my parry gets broken through by guys with axes. I saw you. And I have this like uh, free stamina amount at the start when I'm running towards him. You, you notice that? Like I'm obviously running towards him, but my stamina doesn't drain, and I can go straight into my next sign. Of course, my sword's breaking. Hold on, hold on. I gotta repair my sword. In the middle of this grand epic combat. Just gotta. Just gotta pause time and just... there we go, that's better. Dodging towards him does feel like an effective strategy. Who hits there? Not bad. Yeah, 
feel like we're nearing the end. Oh, we did. We did it. Time to get you. Burn you to death. That was a long fight. One death, we're learning. I can handle that. Where's Siri? What? I thought you knew. All I know is Avalok might have betrayed us. What the? That a storm? Geralt, look! That's where I went the first time I thought I was going to the end of the game. What? What the hell's happening? I find it damned hard to believe, but... The gate between the worlds is open. We must reach the tower, quickly. Stop Avalok, while this can still be reversed. At least we know where to look for Siri. Follow me, and stay alert. Did I let... no. I'm gonna end this video here actually. Thank you so much for watching. My hat is off to you.